it is time for the eclipse. So the solar filter is going on and then just gonna have it pointed at the sun for the next few hours. There we go. Oh, Megan. Is this super sweet? Yeah. yeah. It takes so, longer to up the Is it already started? Whoa. This footage is sped up by a factor of 10. Um, the reason the sun appears to be moving up and to the right is because that's how the sun was actually moving. Due to the rotation of the Earth, the sun's apparent motion across the sky means that I had to keep repositioning the uh, camera. Um, I also ended up cutting out about three quarters of the footage or so because in real time the covering and uncovering um, portions of the eclipse each took over an hour or so. Um, just to make this a watchable length video I had to get rid of some of that. Alright, so real quick we've got some cool pinhole stuff going on so gonna stop looking at the eclipse for just a moment. A pinhole camera is basically just when you have a small hole um, it's gonna project the image of the light source, so in this case the sun. So normally if you just make a small hole like with your fingers in sunlight the image that you'll see on the ground in your shadow is a circle because the sun is a circle. But now that the sun is no longer a circle you're gonna start seeing the image the image of the sun the bite out of it. It's getting colder. You get the idea. A tree is going to have a bunch of little gaps just between the leaves. And so back here we see the image of the sun with the bite taken out of it like all over the place. That's pretty cool. Leo, what do you think of the eclipse, bud? I like muffin. Oh, that's good. <laughs> what do you think of the eclipse? It's pretty cool. Do you feel it's starting to get colder? Yeah, definitely colder and yeah. it's like a crescent moon shape right now. Didn't manage to get that great of footage of the pinhole effect, so um, here's a picture that my brother actually took using a colander that worked out really well. And you can see that every little hole in the colander ended up projecting the image of the sun with the bite taken out of it like this. Eight minutes until the Ooh. Observe animal behavior. Desi. We're observing her. And yeah. also Leo. Is it is it nighttime? Night. Is the sun going down? Oh. Do you need to go inside and go to bed? <laughs> <laughs> so in the next shot here, you're going to hear us describing the surroundings. I wish I had a second video camera to have shown you, but um, I'll put links in the video description to videos that will give you a good idea of what it was like. One minute. Oh, yeah. oh, all is, right, I'm is ready going to be like a sunrise everywhere? Isn't that what you're yeah. saying? Yeah, it will look like a sunrise or a sunset when? all around the horizon when? during well, totality. How I can see the sun, I can, it looks like a so, sunset on the horizon. Oh, here they are, here they are, look! Where? Oh yeah, snakes! Where? I don't right here, oh, yeah, right here. Yeah, yeah. Oh yeah, the shadow snakes. Uh. <laughs> it's so cool. <laughs> 30 seconds. Whoa. Don't miss it's the just, beads. It looks, yeah. it looks Don't like miss the beads. Shadows. All right, so I'm going to take the filter off now. So Already? might oh my God. not work very well. Oh my gosh, look at this, Megan. I can't. Whoa, that's so cool. The sun. That's look so at the cool. Sun, Marco. There's only one more. What are we supposed to see? <laughs> Just a little oh, it's sliver. It's so dark. Okay, so oh, there's the beads. <gasps> beads. That's beads no, down. that's the diamond ring. Can the beads should be look? like now, not can yet. Look? Now you can look. Oh my God. Marco. Holy oh, look God. Out <laughs> Whoa. This is way cooler than I thought it would be. I know. It really, <laughs> that's what I feel. <laughs> Holy crap. Oh. Holy okay, cow. Okay, looks like a sunset everywhere. Oh yeah, but you God. just can't see it in these pictures. Yeah. I know, the pictures don't do justice at all. No! You just have to sit here and experience it. Oh my goodness, look at that. Leo. Try and get Leo to look. Look! Look, look that look. one's... What is that one? Mercury! No, no Mercury should, Mercury be, should be right by the sun. That's like... I don't know what that is, but that's a planet. Oh, I'm not gonna even look it up. I'm just watching this. Holy cow! I think I can see Mercury, maybe. We're at max totality right now. Do you see it, Leo? Yeah. Bottom left. Yeah, We're I see halfway Mercury. Halfway through the totality. Really? Yeah, bottom yeah, you, left. You can see a star oh yeah, right there. that's 
<laughs> even see Mercury. You can never see Mercury. You can see, is that Mercury? Oh, look all around. Look all around. There's the sunset thing. Hilka. Oh, look over there. There's like the 360 sunset thing. Oh, yeah, 360 Do you see Mercury? It's the faintest little thing. I don't. Bottom left. See that, like, yeah. you know, just to the left of that. Like, maybe, like. I think my eyes just aren't good enough. Yeah. Where's your glasses? Oh my god. What's that? There's 30 seconds left. I don't see Mercury though. Which one is Mercury? 30 seconds and then you go to No, it's it's like 10 seconds. You need to have your glasses back on in 10 seconds. Okay, it's starting. Okay, yeah, glasses back on, glasses back on. <laughs> oh, but it's so cool, but so bright. Wait, we got more snakes? Not? Yeah, there should be more snakes happening here. <laughs> Is there like a phenomenon when we it got comes snakes? Back? Oh, we got Do Bailey's beads? The snakes are back. Yeah. So Bailey's beads and the diamond ring would have already yeah, happened. Yeah, they're, there. oh. they're so cool. So I don't know if it's showing up on the video or not, but we got the shadow snakes going on right now. Oh, look at the sun, Can you see it? The, like oscillating pattern. It's crazy how, how just that, that small like amount is so bright. Yeah. Huh. I the know. sun is so powerful. It's so bright again. Leah, what just happened? So it was nighttime, and now the it's sun is rising. Wow. Oh. so dark for a second. That's really weird. Wow. <laughs> I'm lighting it. Oh, I saw like it's one a wet, crow. It's a wet rock. Yeah. It was in this yeah, water bowl. Right. Birds to go nuts. Shadow snakes are basically over. I don't think they showed up on the camera at all. But <laughs> That's his really voice. Getting less and less pronounced. So I'm gonna put it. She loves. Also doesn't like the birds going. What in the world? Hilka. Hilka. Oh, that was so incredible. That was so cool. That was nice. That was really cool. I completely agree with Megan. That was way cooler than I thought it would be. I completely agree with you. Wow. That was so cool. I'm so glad we were here where we got to see it for. Because if you're not in the total, like, it's, it's, it's not a slow. One of the other people we were watching the eclipse with named Chris ended up taking this picture during totality. He has a much nicer camera than me, and it turned out awesome. If you look really closely at about 1 and 3 o'clock, um, there's two what are called CMEs, coronal mass ejections. The sun just spews this matter, this plasma, um, from the surface of the sun out into the sun's um, atmosphere called the corona, and it leaves these huge plumes that are just awesome. A couple of other cool things about total eclipses, the moon's shadow ends up creating its own weather patterns. The temperature drops so much that it ends up creating its own low pressure system. And since air always moves from areas of high pressure to low pressure, the wind is always blowing towards the shadow. So as totality was approaching, we felt the wind blowing one way, and then after the shadow had passed, the wind was blowing the other way. Also, where we were at in Oregon, the moon's shadow is moving at over 2,000 miles an hour. And supposedly, if you're on a mountaintop, you can actually see it approaching. I hope somebody got footage of that. Supposedly, if you look in the very bottom left corner, there's a tiny sliver of the moon left until right now. That is the end of the solar eclipse. Well, that was quite the experience. Leo. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. That was a fun eclipse. Bye-bye.